Yo guys, what is up with this shrimp cup? Welcome back to another Call of Duty mobile video. Today's video guys, I'm going to go ahead and show you some ways that you can earn some free stuff in Call of Duty Mobile right now on top of some really cool power positions in Hackney Yard, which I don't know if a lot of people know about. So I wanted to go and show you guys in this video today and let's just go ahead and jump right into this year. Alright guys, so we're here on Call of Duty Mobile obviously. We're going to go ahead and click events on the left hand side here. We're going to actually scroll over to featured. And then we're actually going to go ahead, go down here to Game Update Rewards. Guys, make sure you reserve your rewards. We have another 15 days till the new season, all right? So make sure you get your spot in so you can get a free Gold Crate Coupon. You get two free Epic Credit Crates, which aren't anything crazy, but hey, free stuff is free stuff. And of course, we actually get this pretty awesome calling card. It's not animated or anything, but hey, I like calling cards, so that's pretty cool. Alright guys, once you scroll down to Hack and Slash and Undead Uprising, these are ways that you can get medals, which I did mention in a previous seasonal video. These are basically a currency that allows you to get, well, more free stuff. As you guys can see, we have a little shop of, you know, some custom items and everything. They're blue rarity, but hey, they're still pretty cool. We got some profile customization, which I went in and picked up this one because that is pretty awesome, guys. More profile pictures, calling cards, super awesome stuff to get, guys. Your top gear, obviously, you can get an epic QQ9. Looks pretty awesome. And, of course, you can get this battle-hardened neon fire skin, which is, those have been out for a while. Let me show you guys some new rewards that you can earn. If we scroll up to high speed, low drag here, we're going to come up on this screen. Basically, guys, make sure you log in for the next week and a half because you are actually going to get some free crates which actually have some pretty awesome stuff let's go ahead and take a look at these rewards as you can see we have this pretty awesome cr amax skin i mean look at that thing that i love the colors i love the shininess and i like the texture of it all it blends together very nicely and i'll probably be rocking this once i unlock it and of course the next thing is going to be this awesome j358 yeah j358 we got more of this theme here, super awesome. I definitely hope I can get this because I would love to rock this pistol because I don't really have any super cool pistol skins, so that's pretty awesome, guys. And of course, you have some other stuff. I actually really like this bone china, this plate here. That's actually a pretty cool keychain. And of course, we have some sprays and some other pretty decent rewards. But guys, basically you want to log in for it looks like up to eight days, guys, and you get a bunch of these crates. So you get four, three, two, one. You get ten total of these crates if you do log in for nine days. So that's pretty awesome, guys. Make sure you're logging in and claiming these rewards so you can open them up whenever you want to. Now, me personally, I'm probably going to save these crates for the massive crate opening. But anyway, guys, with that out of the way, let's go ahead and jump into Hackney Yard because I want to show you guys a pretty cool power position that... Like I said, from my experience playing Hackney Yard on COD Mobile, not many people know about this spot. So I actually wanted to go ahead and show you guys. We have a clan note on Hackney Yard 24-7. So let's hope I don't get search and destroy. And let's go ahead and jump into this here. And it's search and destroy. Oh my shrimp! I know a lot of you guys out there really do enjoy search and destroy. And I do too occasionally. But I just, I one life game modes really aren't my vibe. It's not really my game bro wait a second okay how did he just send me an invite because i have reject all invitations on what the shrimp anyway guys yeah i'm not the biggest fan of search and destroy i would much rather play domination hardpoint all those modes 10v10 hardcore search and destroy is just not really my favorite it's also because i'm bad at the game all right everyone if you spawn on this side of the map as you can see we're on the bottom part of this map you actually want to turn to your left here and jump up these little barrels. You're gonna jump up here. One, oh my, fr run across the fence here, jump on the roof, and that's basically it, guys. This is actually a pretty good overlook of the map. Oh my gosh. There we go, oh my gosh. There we go. You're probably gonna wanna use a better weapon, or at least, you know, put some range attachments if you're gonna chill here, because some would call this a camping spot, guys, but I would agree not because you can look over this area. You can actually run across over here. Some guy's got the Mythic QQ9. And you can check out this part of the map, too. And in Search and Destroy, the bomb is right there. So it's actually a pretty good place to camp. I mean, not camp. I got a little bit of a better weapon for range, guys. We're going to go and go back to the spot. We're going to use our top tier Sentinel gameplay. There you go. Like I said, jump up here, up here. And up here, there you go. It's the, probably the quickest way. You can also go through this building over here. If we jump down, and you go through this building. 
Just go up the stairs. And you can access it from over here too, but to me, this method going over here is way faster, so. There we go. I'm so bad with my aim on the phone, dude. Oh, well, there you go. What, what an eventful game. Alright, everybody, well, that's actually going to go ahead and do it for this quick little video here. Just a reminder, if you have not entered my giveaway, the giveaway is almost done taking entry, so if you want to enter, click the link in the description below. Alright, everybody, well, like I said, that's actually going to go ahead and do it for this Call of Duty mobile video. If you did enjoy, go ahead and drop it a like, maybe subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!